Hello, good evening. Hi. Good evening. Good evening, Gabriel. How are you? I'm very tired. <laughs> really? <laughs> How was your weekend? The weekend was so so. <laughs> Okay, maybe you didn't rest enough. <laughs> you needed more rest. Yes, I need <laughs> one month. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, guys, welcome to the last class of the beginner two. Um, today is the class number 16, and it's Monday, June 19th. We are going to uh, finish the topic, can and can't. So at the end of the class, you will learn vocabulary for discussing different abilities and talents. Okay, so those are the activities we have, recalling previous knowledge, talking about talents, likes and dislikes. We are going to <clears throat> review this topic and wrap up. Okay, but first I am going to take attendance. So no. We're going to do something before taking the attendance, but uh, <clears throat> we're going to play a game that is called a Stop the Bus. Have you ever played Stop the Bus before? Stop the Bus? Well, today you're going to study or you're going to play Stop the Bus. Okay, for this, you need to copy the chart with these categories. In your notebook, please copy. Copy the categories, letter, name, verb, food, adverb frequency, object, country, <clears throat> and total. So we're going to review vocabulary, grammar from the, the discourse from discourse. <clears throat> And while you do this, I'm going to take the attendance, okay? So be ready to say, present teacher, I am here. Okay, so please copy. Okay, uh, Alba Jocelyn Tobar, Al Alba Jocelyn Romero, sorry. Alba Jocelyn Romero, is she present? Present. Thank you, Alba. Anamalia Beatriz Tobar. Present. Ana Julia Flores. Ana Julia Flores. Anderson Emanuel Palomo. Arely Janet Cornejo Rivas. Present teacher. Thank you, Arely. Brenda Dimas. Bonilla. Present. Thank you, Brenda. Briseida Yarisa Melgar. Carlos Adolfo García. Carlos Manuel Velázquez. Carlos Manuel. Oh. 
And I forgot to say Briseida Janet. Briseida Janet Garcia. Briseida Janet Garcia. Okay. Selina Yasmin Perez. Present teacher. Thank you, Selina. Cindy Fabiola Molina. Present. Cindy Claudia Carolina Cruz. Present. Cristian Josué Leiva. Present. Okay, Cristian. Daniel Enrique Ayala. Daniel Quijano Gutiérrez. Present teacher. Okay. Edith Carolina Rivera. Eduardo Enrique Vázquez. Elsa Noelia Portillo. Present. Thank you, Elsa. Erika Noemi. Present. Stephanie Garcia Ángel. Stephanie Adaí Garcia. Evelyn Janet Rivera. Fátima Jocelyn Portillo de Rodas. Gabriel Isaac Guevara. Present. Gabriela Alexandra López. Gerardo Arturo Guzmán. Present. Thank you, Gerardo. Jacqueline Beatriz Vigil Sánchez. Ginny Lisset Escobar. Present. And Jose Heriberto Durán. Present, teacher. Okay, is there someone that I didn't mention? Okay. Thank you so much. So I imagine uh, that you finished copying. Did you finish copying all the categories from the stop the bus game? Yes, I finished. Okay, good. So as you notice in this example, I will say a letter and you have to write a word under each category according to that letter. For example, here I chose the letter A. A. So I have to write a name with A, Anthony, verb, arrive, food, apple pie, Alvaro frequency, always, Object, airplane, country, Argentina. So you have to complete all the categories with a word that starts with the letter that we mentioned, that we chose. And if you finish, when you finish, you say stop the bus. If you are the first to finish, you say stop the bus. And the others stop. You stop. Okay. Maybe you have played this in Spanish. Have you played Stop the Bus in Spanish? Bachillerato Stop. <laughs> have you played in Spanish? No, Gabriel says no. Amalia, have you played Bachillerato Stop? No. Yes, they have. No. Amalia says no. No remember. You don't remember. No remember. No. And you, Ariberto, do you remember? Yes. Yes, you have played Stop yes. the Bus before. Okay, but Amalia, did you understand the dynamic? Yes. Okay, so this is the example. Now I'm going to say... Um, let me think about the letter. Okay, can we do it with the letter S? Letter S. Letter S. Okay? Yes. So you have to complete all of these with the letter S. Number. Numbers. 
Stop bus. Very good. Okay, stop the bus. Five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Everybody stop. Okay, what name do you have with letter S? I, uh, with letter S, S. Um, Name Sophie. Food salad. Uh, outdoor of frequency sometime. Uh, object suit. Uh, country Sudan. And the verb? The outdoor of frequency or verb? The verb, right after the name, we yeah. have a verb with the letter S. <laughs> you forgot. Okay. <laughs> forget <it>. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and the others, any other person would like to say what you have? Maybe Brenda or Ginny or Heriberto or Amalia or Adeline, Selena. Stephanie. Selena, okay, Selena. Your, your microphone. Yes. Letter S. A name Sandra. Their swim. Food. Soap. And advert of frequency. Sometimes. Object. Sofa. E. Country. Serbia. Very good, excellent. Okay, Thanks. somebody else? Jimmy. Yes, teacher. Uh, the name Susan, bear, sit, full, sala, at better frequency, sometimes, object, sofa, country, Spain. Spain, very nice. Okay, remember if you have the same word as other person, you will get only five points. If nobody has the same word, you have 10 points. Okay, with the um with the food, you also have a strawberry, sandwich, right? And you said soup. Very nice. Streams. Eliberto? Okay. It's um, some uh, bird eat uh, hot, hot dog. Uh, always. Uh, um, in object is uh, the street. In USA. Okay, Heriberto, you have to start the words with the letter S. S. Uh -huh. all, all the words need to start with the letter S. What what word do you have? Ah, okay, okay. And some um, uh, maybe uh, see. Sim. <laughs> Where is some? Um, the food. Food is uh, salad. Mm -hmm. Salad and and always uh, is um, sometime. Sometime. Yeah, frequency sometime. Sometime and the object you said. 
Serbia. <laughs> the country. Very Serbia. nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, are you ready for the next word, next letter? The next letter would be the letter O. O. Letter O. The letter O, yes. With the letter O. Teacher, como yo entendí. Hola, hello. Yes, Arely, we listen to you. Con ese es el asunto. Now, no, we speak, now it's with the letter O. Ah, vaya, yo hice la oración así. A, a Steven, drink coffee always in the cafeteria. In the town in the Houston, Texas. <laughs> okay, Arely, you you made up a story. <laughs> wait, wait for the story. But in this moment, you need to do. I mean, to complete the categories with the letter O, name, verb, food. Upper frequency, object, and country. Finished with the letter O, or is it difficult? No. Oscar. <laughs> Are you finished? Oh, nice. no, no. You're finished. Not finished yet. Yeah, you're. Yes. Not oh, yet. I. Oscar. Let it all name Oscar verb open. Oh, you're finished, Amelia. Okay, Oscar yes. open food. Uh, orange. Very nice. A uh, frequency often. Often, yes. A uh, object odd. 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 Avena. Oat. Okay. Oat. Oats, eh, Oman, 
the country. country. Yes, very good. Very nice, Amalia. Okay. Hi, hi teacher. Yes. Daniel. Okay. Okay, Daniel. Le okay. Letter, letter O. Yes. Nai Ovidio. Mm -hmm. Better travel. Food, peanut pork. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, Daniel. What is the verb? Uh, the verb travel. But with the letter O. O. Yes, o. it has to start with the letter O. Nay, um, Ovidio. Yes, the name with the letter O, Ovidio. The verb with the letter O. Ah. Amalia said open. Yes. Maybe yeah. organize. Organize. Um, okay, organize. 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 Uh, yes. Food with uh, the O. Or is uh, orange. 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 Food, orange. Um, Adverbio a frequency. Ah, no, no, it's always, it's always, often, often. Often, okay, also often. we have occasionally. Uh, adjective. Object, object. Object. Um, Ese no lo terminé. <laughs> In country? Uh, country. Oh. No me sale con o. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's it's only one country. Oman. Ah, Oman. Oman. Objects okay. with letter O, maybe somebody. Objects. Ocean. Oman. Octopus. Octopus. Objects with letter O. Yes. Ese no lo, no lo terminé, teacher. No finish. Okay, don't worry. We have oven, onion, and the hey, last oh, letter. Yes. Oh, 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 okay. Object, onion. And okay. the last letter will be the letter R. Letter R as in Rocio. Letter R. Letter R. With the letter R.
José Heriberto. Okay. You're finished. Yeah. Stop the bus. Say stop the bus. Stop. <laughs> stop the bus. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, what is the name you have, Heriberto? Raul. What? Raul. Raul, there. Read. Mm -hmm. Read. Read. Good. Radish. Radish, very good. Radish. Yes. Ra 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 relate or rarely. Rarely. I'll be repeating to you. Rarely. Okay. Object. Yeah. Object. It's um, right. Rabbit in country. In country, Russian. Russia. Excellent. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Roberto Gabriel. Name Rick. Verb run. Food radish. Uh, adverb of frequency rarely. Object radio. In country Romania. Romania. Okay. Romania. <laughs> Very good. Nice people. Now, what are you going to do? Well, with the vocabulary you practice, you are going to create a story. Now, Adeli, you have to make the story. <laughs> the story, you have to use all the words that you wrote in the, in, uh, for example, with the letter A. Anthony is my best friend. He is from Argentina. He can go very well. He can make a delicious apple pie. He arrives to El Salvador next weekend. He always travels by airplane. I hope he makes an apple pie for me. Okay, so um, you will choose the letter S or the letter O or the letter R and you have to make a story using all the words with that letter. So you choose the letter S or the letter O or the letter R and make a story. So you will have two minutes to make a story. Try to use the, the grammar we studied, for example, can, uh, the verb to be, the adverb of frequency. Okay, do you have the story? Mm -hmm. Did you finish the story?
What letter did you choose, Amalia? Oh, no, not, not finished. Ah, but you are making the story with the letter O. Oh. Um, I made it. And you, Brenda? What letter, Brenda? Uh, no, no he finalizado, pero tengo una parte. Dice, Daniel is my uncle. Uh, uncle, mi tío. He is from China. He can dance in merengue to perfection. He has fun in the village dance. He arrived to San Miguel the next month. Okay, Brenda, thank you so much. Thank you. Gabriel? Uh, and my letter is the is S. Uh, she is Sophie and she thinks very well. Her favorite food is the salad. Sometimes used soup to work. She lives in Sudan. Very nice. So you were working with the letter S. Okay. Somebody else? One more story. Okay. Jeannie? My letter is R. R, okay, R, R. sorry, R. Rachel is my roommate. She's from Republica Dominicana. She cooked a delicious rice with meat. She rare, rarely read a newspaper. She prefers read a book in her cell phone. She can play tennis with a racket. Very nice, I like your story. Good job, Jeannie, excellent, okay. Thank, Thank you. you for sharing and working in this activity. Okay, now guys, we are going to classify the different talents and abilities. Uh, we can have musical or artistic abilities, technical abilities, athletic or other abilities, right? So we are going to classify, we're going to classify the abilities. And mm -hmm. where is here? So you're going to help me to classify the different abilities. For example, we have bake cookies is other. Build a robot. Build a robot. Is it musical, artistic, athletic, or technical? Or other? Maybe Build technical? Is technical, okay. Build a robot. Design a website? Musical. Design mm. a website. Technical. It's technical too. Do math in your head. Other. Other, okay. Yeah, there are people who can do math in their head. Very easy. Edit a video. Okay. Edit Technical. a video. Ten, ten, ten. Technical? Okay. Technical. What about um, fix a computer? It's technical, it's technical too, right? Mm -hmm. Fix a computer. And make electronic music? Musical. Music. Musical. Um, play chess? Uh, athletic. Athletic, okay. Play chess. 
ride a horse? Athletic. 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 Run a marathon? Athletic. 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 A skateboard? Athletic. Take good photos? Other. <laughs> For artistics. <laughs> or artistic. Or artistic. Yes. yes, right. Artistic because the art artists take good photos. Uh, tell good jokes. <laughs> Other. Other. Okay. It's order. Okay, very nice. So we can classify, right, the different talents or abilities we have. Good. Thank you so much. Now, guys, in the next slide, in this exercise, you are going to listen. You are going to listen to the, the, the talent show. This is a, a show on television. Um, in the talent show, people participate showing their talents. Maybe they can dance, they can sing, they can play music, or they can tell jokes or or doing different things to entertain people. So you are going to listen to this exercise, okay? Um, give me a moment, I'm going to share with you. Is me. It's just a can share. Okay, so you have to listen and order the text from one to three. You will tell me what is the number one, what is the number two, or the number three. Excuse me. Okay, number one. Who is the winner of the talent show? Sally, you're a great dancer, and you're very beautiful. But you can't speak Spanish, so don't sing Spanish songs. I'm sorry, but you aren't tonight's winner. You're a good band. Matt, you can play the drums well, and Rick, you're great on the keyboard. Zoe, you can play the guitar very well, but you can't sing. Sorry, get a new singer and come back next year. Leona, you are fantastic. You can sing well and dance too. You've got a lot of talent. And you are tonight's winner. Okay, so the, this Leona, you are fantastic is the number? Three. 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 Okay, what a good band, Matt. You can play the drums. Three, you are with viewers. Is number two. 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 And this is the number one. Oops. Okay. One. Now, listen again, and we are going to answer the question Who is the winner of the talent show? Do you remember? Leona. Leona. <laughs> can Sally dance? Do you remember? Can Sally dance? Uh, no sé cómo se llama. Sally, you were a great Sally. dancer. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. Yours are great dancer. Can Sally dance? Yes. Yes, she, yes. Can. Yes, she can. Yes. yes, she can. Can Sally speak Spanish? No. Yeah. No. Um, no. She no, can't. She can. no, she she can. can. no, she can't. No, she can't. No, can Matt play the drums? Yes, he can. Yes, he can. Can Sui play the guitar? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes she, can. she can. Yes, she can. Can Sui sing well? Uh, yes. Sui, you can play the guitar very well, but you can't sing. 
No, she can't. 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 Can Leona sing and dance well? Yes, she can. Yes, she can. Yes, she can. Very nice. Let's check the answers. Oh. And that's correct. Very good. You are a too nice winner. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very nice. So we were reviewing the topic of uh, the using can and can't, right? Using can and can't for a, uh, oh, what happened to my class? Give me a moment. I lost my class. So as I, as I was telling you, we were practicing the use of can and can't, right? Now, I want you to review the topic of likes and dislikes. Uh, we usually use these words, like we, we usually talk about the things we like or we don't like, but it is important to know how, how to use these verbs and what other verbs you can use. I just in a moment because I'm looking for my presentation here again. Had a problem. Okay, it's ready. Good. So when we talk about our likes and dislikes, we use a, the verb like or in negative form, don't like. And the structure is like this, subject, the verb. And then we can say a noun or we can use a verb in ing form. Look at the examples. My mom likes cooking. Well, it's third person singular, so I add S. My mom likes cooking. Cooking is a verb, but in the ing form. Or I can use a noun, for example, I love tacos. I love tacos. Tacos is not a verb, it's not an, an action in ing, it's a noun, okay? So I can use either an ing verb or I can use a noun. And we have examples here. I like running, look running. I don't say I like run. I say I like running or I oh, don't yeah. like running. You like running. You don't like running. He likes, because it's third person singular, he likes running. In the third person negative, he doesn't like running. She likes running. She doesn't like running. Okay, so you're going to help me here to complete what is the correct option. What is the correct option? You're going to help me. For example, it says he painting models. If you notice here, painting is in the ing. Okay? And the verb is like. So he likes painting models. She going to the cinema. What is the verb here? Likes. Okay. Nice. She likes going to the cinema. I like. I like doing exercise. I going fishing. Like. Okay. Like. I like going fishing. If you notice, it's in the ING. He likes painting. She likes going. I like doing exercise. I like going fishing. Do you like, like. playing basketball? <laughs> yes, I do. Now, what is here the correct auxiliary? Does. Exactly, does. 
Does he like doing exercise? No, he doesn't. <laughs> okay. And here? What does, does she like? Does she like? And what is the verb? Um, maybe doing. Doing, exactly. Doing gymnastics. You remember the class in which we we'll learn about the sports? Do yeah. gymnastics. So does she like doing gymnastics? Okay, we can say no, I don't. 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 Yes, she doesn't. Yes, she, doesn't. she does. No, he don't. Doesn't. Doesn't. No, he doesn't. And yes, doesn't. I I do. Yes, I yes, do. I do. Uh -huh. So you just have to be careful with the auxiliaries, the auxiliaries that you use. Now, in the next slide, you will see here that to say the things we like, we can use other verbs, not only the verb like. We can use the verb low. And we can use also the verb enjoy. And in negative, we can use I don't like, dislike, or even hate. Don't like, dislike, and hate. Hate is, you really, really, really don't like it. And look at the examples I have here. I enjoy cooking. I love watching movies with my husband. I like pupusas and tacos. So if you notice, I am using enjoy and the verb ing, love and ing, and like and nouns. I can also say I like cooking or I love cooking. Or I can say I enjoy watching movies or I like watching movies with my husband. And negative, I don't like ironing the clothes. I hate the traffic. I don't like being sick. So again, I'm using, or I can say I dislike. I dislike being sick. So after like, remember, if you use another verb, the verb must be in ing form. Or I can use a noun. Can you make this uh, three examples, like my example, similar? One example with like, with love and enjoy, and one example with don't like, dislike, and hate. Okay, please write your own example. Your examples, please. Oh, I don't get it. I want to read your examples.
I want to read your examples. Reading, like, love, enjoy, don't like, dislike, and hate. You can type your examples in the chat. Or you can open your microphone and share. Do you have your examples, guys? Hi, teacher. Mm -hmm. Please, Daniel. Um, I like chicken soup i love chicken i love chicken soup chicken soup soup, soup. yes um i don't like chicken soup i have chicken soup i hate i hate chicken soup 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 soup, soup. yeah soup is how long Okay. The soup. <laughs> Thank you. Sure. Okay, and do you have an example with the using ing, the verb in ing? An example with the verb in the ing form. Remember, you can use a noun or you can use a verb in a form. Brenda, do you have your example? Or Erica? Um, I like his cream. I love the rain. I know I don't like the heat. Sería calor, creo. Mm -hmm. I don't like the heat. I hate ironing clothes. I hate ironing the clothes. Me too. <laughs> okay, Jeannie. Jimmy, we don't listen, Jimmy. 
I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. I, I like going to the beach. Yeah. I love I love eating dinner with my family. Uh -huh. I always enjoy with my nephew. I don't like eating onions. <laughs> <laughs> I dislike when my head hurts. Oh, when your head hurts. Yeah. Yeah. And I hate the hot days. Yes, calurosos. Oh, the hot days. Okay. The hot days. Good job, Jimmy. Good job. Thank you for sharing, Thank Gabriel. You. I enjoy running in the park. Nice. I love playing with my daughters. Mm -hmm. I like the mountain and forest. I don't like cleaning the kitchen. <laughs> One example. <laughs> it's just an example. <laughs> I hate the bad people. I don't like being around people. You don't like being around people. Well, just example. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay, Gabriel, thank you so much for your examples. You were using nouns and also verbs in ING form. Do we have another volunteer? Hi. Okay, Areli. <laughs> We listen to you, Areli. I enjoy work. I like chicken orange. Mm -hmm. I love I love watching movies with my sons. I don't like ironing in the closer. No me gusta la planchada. <laughs> I don't need the clothes. Neither do I. Uh, I don't like to be alone. <laughs> Good job. Thank you, Arely. Thank you for your examples. Well, guys, we have only two more minutes. But um, let's look at this exercise. It's the last, it's the wrap up. But it's a, um, a writing exercise. Hello, my name is Robert. I'm nine years old. I like sports. I can play tennis, swim, surf, ski, and skate, but I can't play football. I like music too. I can play the piano and the guitar, but I can't sing karaoke. I can also speak three languages, English, French, and Italian. I can cook. I can make pizza, pasta, and cake. What about you? What can you do? Well, this is going to be your homework. Okay, I will send you the link so that you can write about your own abilities, the things that you can do, the things that you like. Everybody, every person has a lot of talents. So I'm sure you have your own talents. So I will send you uh, the link. You can do it. You can do this exercise as a practice for your English. And well, guys, this, is, this was the last class of module two. And I don't know if you have some comments, guys, about the class. <laughs> thank you, thank you for your participation. And I hope that you can continue with your learning of English. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome, Marily. <laughs> Good night. Good night for you too. <laughs> okay, so it was a pleasure for me to be your first. Hasta la vista, baby, dice. See you around. <laughs> See you soon. Maybe in another course. Maybe in pre-intermediate or intermediate or advanced. Who knows? <laughs> okay, people. Take care. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.